Hello Crafty family and welcome to another video by She's So Crafty. It's Shopping Sunday and we are headed to our favorite store, the Dollar Tree, to see what's new on the shelves. Now please forgive my voice today, I am recovering from being sick, but we are going to get through this together. So let's dive into all of the new finds. Now I'm starting in the spring collection, you guys. They have come out with a new collection of craft things. These are craft windmills, you guys. They have them in all of your favorite garden style insects. These are ready to be painted and customized for your garden. And they have the different color of little fans on the front. These would be so fun to paint and add to your garden decor in all of the different styles. They also have these. These are actually craft wood animal picks. You can see they have snails here. That's really cute. They also have little hedgehog looking pieces, you guys. They had so many. I think that the wood items this year, the Dollar Tree, are really coming out fierce this year. They have more wood than I've ever seen at the Dollar Tree. And I think that this is so fun and such an incentive for the new shoppers at Dollar Tree and also us OGs who also shop at the Dollar Tree. Now look at this wood sign. So this laser cut wood welcome sign is really cute. It's got the little boot for the L. I love this one. And they also have one that says garden. It's got a watering can and a little bird. So adorable to paint or stain for your decor. Now here's another fun kit that they had in the little garden section. This has all the garden critters. These are the wind chime kits, you guys. So you can paint, stain these, hang these up, decorate them indoor or outdoor. It's all got all of your spring garden critter designs on there. So fun for yourself or for the kiddos to participate in. Now this is probably one of my favorites today in the little spring collection of the wood. They have these five packs of these large flower cutouts, you guys. These have five packs that are pretty generous size and they also come with strings to hang them. So this is definitely one of the great finds they have for 125. And here's another awesome find, metal. Now I love the metal birdhouses they have. I had been on the lookout for these. They also have these in little watering cans. Now these are on a little metal stake, but you can remove that stake to use it for any craft that you want to, but such a great deal at 125. Now speaking of metal, they have metal signs as well that say welcome. They have this one here. This one's really pretty. It's really fun. It says garden, got the watering can and the garden gloves above the A. How cute is that? And they even have this one that says hello. So you can find an assortment of different metal items as well as the wood. Now, uh, speaking of metal, it just keeps getting better. They had all kinds of metal shapes for garden decor, from mushrooms, birds, butterflies, bees, all different kinds. I was actually really surprised that they had such a large variety of the metal cutouts. I'd never seen this many metal cutouts presented for the spring, but when I did see them, I was really excited. I saw them, I knew that I could probably decorate with them because if you know and you follow me, you know I love to garden. So these are perfect to kind of accent around my personal garden area. And also you can use them in your crafting. Now here's some potted flowers in a little watering can. They had those in metal. You can have these flowers in a little clay looking pot in a metal design. I think this one is really pretty as well. And then they had a third one that had leafy plants inside. So if you see these, grab them. I have a feeling they won't last long. Now, if you're into bees, they had a whole end cap full of bee type of decor at the Dollar Tree. They had this sign that said, be happy. And also they had a die cut honeycomb style wood design with little bees on there. I thought that was really unique, brand new at the Dollar Tree. They have this bee with the stripey tail and then they have this solid color one or the solid one here is shown. But these would be perfect to paint and decorate or even use them in fun wreath designs. 
Now, as far as the signs, they did have this B humble sign, which was really pretty. And they little had a B, they had a B here that said be kind. I think that these were both adorable. Now, I always love these tiered little signs that they have at the Dollar Tree. I think they make such a statement. Really pretty. I love the yellow, black, and white combination on these. Now, in the spring section, the frogs are back. Now, if you saw these last year, I just thought these were just so fun. So they have lounging frogs. They have frogs that are thinking frogs. They have frogs that are just kicked back with the arms behind the head just relaxing you guys you could use these as is in your garden you can paint or customize them i think these are so fun and if you are into gnomes they had the little gnomes as well they had them with a different color hats different color um the sweaters and belts and pants you guys they had an assortment of gnomes i think i saw some of these last year but i'm happy to see them back now, if you're into the little fairy garden decor, the little flower typed huts are back. They had so many new ones, so many, these are so pretty. So if you are looking to put together your fairy garden or just love to have these little houses in your plants, I think that would be so much fun. Now, I did see another tray of them. These have the mushroom topped little pieces in there I think that these are beautiful as well so they give you a good variety to choose from whether you want flowers or if you want mushroom tops Now for beach theme, they have this little tugboat. How cute is this? So this is part of the fairy collection as well. It has the tugboat here. That's really cute. They also have the van with the surfboard on the top, which is really fun. Now they did have the tow trailer behind it. So yeah, I flipped it over so you could take a look there. That one is cute. And then they had so many other ones in a beach theme as well. If you're into, you know, sea creatures, here's one with the octopus on a rock. They also had another one with a mermaid kind of lounging on a rock with seashells. And they have a rock with a little sea horse on them. You guys, from the little huts and houses to all of the little sea creatures, I think the Dollar Tree has us all covered in the miniatures this year. So these are just coming out. If you haven't seen them at your Dollar Tree, keep an eye out. They are possibly on the way. And in the garden center, I have featured these little three pot sectional planters before, but here are the largest ones, just in case you're looking for them. They're $1.25 each and they come in three colors. Now here's another new pot that I've never seen before. These are galvanized metal, you guys, solid. I've never seen these before. I did grab a few of them for a couple of crafts, so grab them if you see them. And look at these planters. Now, I've seen variations of this in the past, but I love these, the little lacy tie, uh, the top on them. It just gives them such a really pretty accent. So adorable. Now, I am excited about this farmhouse collection, you guys. Look at this plank style water bottle with a printed chicken on there. I think this is so cute. And then they had a variety of round signs home sweet home and welcome with little accents of burlap and black and white striped ribbon so farmhouse i'm loving all of this collection now this is possibly one of my favorite pieces in it the little pig now this is a real metal kind of corrugated galvanized metal piece happiness is homemade and here is another milk bottle type of plank design with the chicken pig and cow printed design on there now, I love these little round hooks that they always have. This one says hello with that metal plank on there. And then it has another one that says love. You could use this year round, not just for Valentine's Day, to hang up different things in your home. And then I reached back in the back to find more and they did have one that said gather. So you could get all three to hang up in your space for your decor. Now here's another one of those fence plank type signs and this one says welcome to our home with the corrugated metal chicken or rooster on the front. 
Now here's a third milk bottle type design with the little farm, sweet farm, and the little pig on the front. Now here's another tag sign that they have. Now they do have these in three different styles. They have them in natural, white, and they do have these in black. I love the metal frame on the front of these. I think that the frame just gives it a little bit more of an upscale look. So I was really excited to find these and I did grab some. So definitely grab them if you see them. And then they have this large pig. This is a large metal pig with a texture on it. This is cute as is. I saw it in white and pink. You could keep this as is or paint them. It depends on your own preference. But I was excited to see this. Great deal at 125 Now they did have these little square signs too. This is us, our story, our life, and our home. They had this to go along with the farmhouse collection as well. So that was new to my Dollar Tree. And the houses are back in a farmhouse style. We saw these for Valentine's Day. Now they have them more in a farmhouse house style so you could choose from either or now in another part of the store I did see these signs so these are like the paddle type chopping boards they had the farm fresh pig with the metal oink wording on top of it and then they had farm fresh um, they had the cow on there that said moo in the metal words And they have one that has a natural tone and says life is better on the farm. Now check out these little chunky chickens. Oh my goodness, I was just like giggling so hard when I saw these. I've never seen these before. I saw them in white and I did see them in black. You guys, these were new to my Dollar Tree. If you're looking for them, keep your eyes out for them. Now they also have these so little votive holders. Now these are shapes of little flowers. They have this minty green one, a beautiful uh, yellow one, and also this one in white. So if you're looking for these, keep an eye out for them. They are gorgeous. And the little pictures are back. So if you missed them on their first release, check them out. They're coming back to the Dollar Tree. Now this was a brand new find in the farmhouse collection today. This love sign with that little windmill as the O. Now I thought it was only love until I looked around the back. They also have home. So you could choose from either one of these to get that farmhouse sign added to your collection. Now and look at these signs. Now these are large paddle type signs. I love the buffalo check trim on these. These would be great to add to anything in your home as far as decor. You can give them in gift arrangements, customize them. They also have them in a style of a chalkboard. I think this, these would be gorgeous to add a personalized message for a new homeowner or anything that you could possibly think of. Now at another store, they were still unpacking the farmhouse, but the young lady was so sweet and let me take a look at the things and look what I found. These beautiful wood slices, generous packages, you guys. These are only $1.25. Now here is another package. This had some wood sticks, kind of like a peg style. All of these have potential to be really good in your crafting. I definitely grabbed some of them. Here are some round little pieces that you could use. Don't have any ideas yet, but stay tuned. I bought a few of them, so I'm definitely going to try to come up with something for you guys. Now here are some new pieces as well. They have this black cow on a stand. Here's the chicken on a stand right here, really pretty. Now these are blank on both sides, so you could use all of these different shapes to customize or keep them as is, add greenery to them. It's all up to you. Now another item that was new is they had that uh, square chalkboard piece like we saw before, except they have a hanging three tag piece from it. So this was new to my Dollar Tree. I think that this can come in handy for a lot of different DIYs. And then they have a new farmhouse arrival on their fabrics, you guys. If you know me, I love to sew. So I was really excited to see some of these farmhouse fabrics to come out. Lots of pretty designs. Some of them I've seen before, but some of them I have not. So they had several different patterns in the box that you could choose from. So and look at these sunflowers. I think these are absolutely gorgeous. 
So check those out. These come in nice size rolls for crafting. Now, if you don't want to buy a rolls and you just want a small assortment of each, it did have pre-cut packaged fabric, but in my opinion, I would get the full rolls. You just get more bang for your buck that way, I believe. So check that out if you go to the Dollar Tree. Now these little house signs are really cute. They had them in a white trim and a natural trim with a black background. You can add some lettering from your Cricut. You could do all kinds of home decor DIYs with these. And if you're into stickers, they had some stickers labeled farmhouse collection. So these had more of a farmhouse type of theme to them. So you could check these out at the Dollar Tree. They just arrived in the collection. They would be perfect addition to add to all kind of DIYs that you may make with any of these items from this collection. Now this has to be one of my favorite signs I found today. This is the three section sign here. I love that top piece with the accent, but then it has two planks dangling right below it. So you could add all kinds of different things to this. So many possibilities with the new farmhouse collection items. Now here's another little house that they have. Now this one has a stand on the back like a picture frame. So you could definitely use this in your crafting. And these round beaded rings are at the Dollar Tree. They have one in round beads that have black. And then they have a natural bead in like a square shape. And this is the natural tone. And then the last one they have is a stained square bead. Grab some of these, you guys. These are gorgeous. If you don't use them for a wreath, you could definitely use the beads. Now, here's some more beads that they had here. These are bead hanging pieces. This is black and natural with metal, corrugated metal charms on the end. And this is another cute one here, this round one with a tassel. I love this little buffalo check beading on there. Really cute. Now, they had some initials as well. So, they had the wood initial with the beading handle on them. You guys, these beaded accents and farmhouse accents are really just keep getting better and better. I'm so excited to see all these new arrivals. Now, another new arrival are these wood planks that you could decorate with. Now, they have them in black, natural, and white, but my Dollar Tree only had black when I went to the store. Now, I don't know how I overlooked these when I first walked in the store, but they did have these large kind of dragonfly looking pieces, and they had some butterfly looking pieces as well. These are actually a really large size, you guys. So I'm excited to see that the pieces of the wood are getting larger for that 125 price point. Now, another new collection, you guys. I'm sure you probably have seen something like this. The copper metal uh, basket collection. Now, my Dollar Tree only had this small hanging basket and this rectangular basket in stock. They did not have any of the squares to hang them on, but I'm keeping my eye out for them. Now, some other things they did have in the copper collection are all of these pieces. So these include like the binder clips. I mean, the copper color on here is so beautiful, you guys. They had all kinds of spring clips. This is the smaller spring clips. And if you want larger ones, they have a two pack of the larger spring clip collection as well. All beautiful pieces. Now they had some extras as well. If you wanted the paper clips, I think these are cute. These are paper clips. They have little stars on them and those come in an eight pack. Now in the home decor section, they also had some new things I'd never seen before. So this is a flower stand. So it's kind of a painted flower made out of acrylic. And what it does is hold a picture. So I thought that was a pretty neat idea. They had three different acrylic flower designs. So you mount it as a stand and then you could clip on a picture of your favorite person or pet into the little clip and display it. So I thought that was a really pretty and unique idea. And more beads, you guys. So I saw these long strands of beads and each one had a tassel and rainbow at the end of it. Now the beads do come in three different styles. I saw this strand of white. They have a strand of multicolor beads to kind of 
match with that rainbow and they had them in black so they had them in three different colors now you don't have to keep these as is of course you can take these apart and use these beads for other things but they did have them available which is awesome so check them out in the home decor section at the Dollar Tree Now, if you love those long wood signs that they come out on all the seasons, they did have some new ones out. Now, these are more of the motivational type of signs. So, I saw these. These are the one-sided ones. You could use these for DIYs or use them for your motivational signs. I felt like these would be great for, you know, a teen's bedroom or an office or anything like that to get you motivated or to get you started on doing whatever you need to do for the day. And this was some new desk decor that I saw. They have the little cups with the gold and pink swirls on them. So I've seen them in Buffalo Check and Solids. I've never seen them in this beautiful pink swirl color. So that was new to my Dollar Tree. Now, if you love oil warm warmers, they had two new styles at my Dollar Tree. Now here is one as a double opening. I saw it in kind of a khaki color, this white one here. And I also saw it in black. So keep your eyes out for those. Very cool and modern looking. Now they had some kind of with a carved face in them as well. I thought these were really nice too. Same a little holder at the top for your oil or your wax melts. You could get those all for $125 at the Dollar Tree. Now check out this. They have this little Easter sign. They had more Easter coming out. They have one that says hop here, really cute. And then they have this Cottontail Farms a truck sign. Now this one kind of looks familiar. I think I've seen this in years past, but still so very cute in the little plank style design. Now they also had the truck in blue that said carrot patch. So that one is really fun as well. Now here's a cute one that says hoppy Easter in pink. And of course, if you're not crazy about the glitter, you could always cover it with some other medium to make it your own. And this one is back to an all-time favorite with the bunnies and the little cotton tails. Now they did have another one of these in pink as well with three bunnies. Now here's another cute bunny sign. Here's one that says, every bunny welcome. It's got those whitewashed wood style planks in the background. And they also had the same one in another style that said Happy Easter with a natural wood plank. And then everybody welcome in an egg shape as well. You can use the front or flip it around for the back for your own personalized DIY. Now I did, I did see just a few Valentine's things that I hadn't seen before. I did see this rainbow one. This is There's No Match better for you for me than you and then then happy valentine's day in these square shapes now these little hearts with the valentine's day shapes on them are gorgeous but you guys these are these square signs we know the square signs can be used for so many diys including calendar pages so i specifically bought several of these to use for calendar pages to use the back because they are the perfect size and shape for them so if you see them, don't just look at them for just Valentine's Day. Look at them for what they could possibly be and other DIYs that you may want to create. And then look at these little cubes. So these are the little cube dice for Valentine's Day. I'd never seen these before. They had them in red, white, and black colorway with all kinds of cute little phrases and sayings on each side. I thought those were cute. And then finally, these little jars with the cork lids. I've never seen them. They say love and date night. I'm definitely going to DIY those. I think those are gorgeous. I hope that you guys are able to find these too. Now, if you missed my shopping video last week featuring hundreds of finds starting at a dollar at the new Pop Shelf store, check it out now by clicking the link in the upper right hand corner of this video or click the link provided in the description box below. Now, I do hope that you guys enjoyed coming along with me on this shopping trip today. And if you want to see what I create with my finds, my DIY videos will be on Tuesdays and Fridays. So set your alarm so you don't miss it. Now listen, if you love shopping at Dollar Tree as much as I do, let me know by giving this video a thumbs up and leave me a comment letting me know 
What was your most exciting find at Dollar Tree recently? Make sure you don't miss a video by subscribing and hit that bell to be notified when we go live. It doesn't cost a thing. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you all next time.